Yo, what up? This is the last MJ. And this is what I want you to do. If you like this video, go to the link in the description right now and click, comment, subscribe, tell your mom, tell her friend, tell your homegirl, tell everybody about this because we the hottest in the land, baby. You dig. And we ain't going nowhere. We taking over. Now we got Caitlin Clark entering the WNBA. Mm -hmm. um, her first game was last night. Mm -hmm. um, she put up 20 but had 10 turnovers. And they lost by about 20. Mm -hmm. um, I, I, what is what is, is is she going to survive in the WNBA or, or? Yeah, she is. She nice. Yeah, yeah, Shorty sure. nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She could shoot. It's just more they, physical. They need to give her the Jordan treatment though. What, what you mean by that? Like you know, you know, like what Magic and Bird and them were saying. Like they, there was a time when the NBA noticed that Magic and Bird was fading, and Jordan and the refs started giving. They started making rules for Michael Jordan. The game shifted. Remember when they started talking about how, like, you know, the LN base, them niggas do crazy yeah, shit. Beat them up. When they started noticing that the other older niggas was fading out, they changed the rules to where you couldn't foul as hard without getting ejected. Mm -hmm. And they did that for Jordan. They was protecting his face. I think they at the some Jordan point, rule. they gonna have to curve some of the rules for Caitlin Clark. Cause mm -hmm. the moment that she looks human again, mm -hmm. niggas, uh, niggas gonna stop watching. It's yep. gonna fuck up their bread. The ratings, yeah. And I think the WNBA need to need to make sure that she get she get off. <laughs> Got to. That's what we pay. Yeah, they, they, they like yeah, whatever little defensive there. strategies them bitches used that last game. They need to take that shit away. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, they didn't let her drop fifty. Yeah. So question: Is this what I was thinking when I was watching the game? Um, Shorty that was guarding Kate, Caitlin Clark last night. What's mm -hmm. her name? Dijanae. I don't remember her name. Dijanae, a dog. Dijanae Karen, Carrington. She's solid though. Yeah. So what I was thinking is, how this works is once you draw the fans in, they're liable to take another opinion once you already have the eyes on them. You know what I'm saying? So Shorty might be, like, I feel like she was put in the conversation because she guarded Caitlyn so well. You know what I'm saying? And I'm thinking with all these extra eyes on the WNBA, like, Asia might finally get her um, just due for winning all these MVPs and finals. She hooped MVPs. last night, too. You know who, who? Asia. Asia Wilson. Wilson. Asia Wilson. Wilson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she got off. She's like the best player in the WNBA, but okay. no one talks about her. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. No, but she's like already got two finals MVPs and two MVPs, right? Mm -hmm. Something like that, yeah. And she yeah. got a whole career ahead of her still, so. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I, I think that, <clears throat> I don't know if the WNBA is going to step their marketing up or if the NCAA is, is upholding it for them because. Well, well well, I don't need, oh, sorry, go ahead, my phone. No, nah, I was just going to say with the NCAA, with the women, they're trying to take some years off now to let them go. Like Juju, like not making her wait to the third year or whatever. So, yeah, I, oh. that's really like the funnel to go to the WNBA. Yeah, I sure. think I think this year it just seemed like the college, it was like a cause and effect. College yeah. propped it up because for the first time in a long time, they had that like jump off the screen talent Dude, for the yeah. women's sport. You know what I'm saying? You had the drama of LSU versus Iowa. Obviously, South Carolina's team is fucking insane. Mm -hmm. You got Juju on the West Coast. You had a lot of Fine. talent, like, and they're doing the step back threes, and they got crazy handles now and shit. And it's like comparable to an extent now, right now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I think Caitlin Clark's gonna be fine. Yeah, uh, she's not gonna have ten turnovers every single game. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? She's gonna bounce back. They're also not gonna like. There's a lot of hype with her coming in the league. They don't want her embarrassing a lot of the vets and shit then someone's not going to be guarding her for 90 feet every single game right, right. and yeah. you know what i'm saying now in the playoffs and stuff like that yeah, she's going to have to deal with that going forward and they'll have to play off right yeah. playoffs <laughs> yeah. they'll, 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 they'll have to screen their ass <laughs> off and find playoff. ways to get her open oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. she's on the worst team yeah, yeah that's she's why the they got team. the number one pick so but i'm saying whenever that happens whenever she gets to that right. point like yeah. she's they're going to have to scheme for that but I mean, she's not Steph, but I'm saying we see teams like Golden State and stuff doing mm -hmm. well where they're screening their fucking ass off, setting three, four screens right, and shit right. like that uh -huh. so people can get their shot. They're going to have to find ways to do it. But like Sai said, she could ball, though. I, th I, th I think she's nice. So I, th I think she's going to figure it out. I don't think she's going to be like